Hi, this is a brand new Windows 11 PC and I have recently installed the newly launched Windows 11 on this 12 years old PC. I know that you won't believe it. But if I show you the hardware configuration, definitely you will believe it. So let me check it that how I have installed the latest Windows 11 on a 12 years old computer. So first I want to show you that I have installed Windows 11 or not. So just right click on this PC icon and go to properties and you will get the Windows version. Yes, you can see that Windows 11 Pro edition and the version is 21H2 and I have installed it on 27th August 2022. So this is the latest Windows 11 edition and you can see my device name, my processor or the total RAM I have installed on my old PC, 12 years old PC. So if you go to download the Windows 11 ISO file then Microsoft suggest you to check the PC health. It means is your PC eligible for installing Windows 11 or not. So I have already installed the PC health checkup app on this Windows 11 PC. And you can see. Yes, it is showing my computer name, total RAM I have installed and total hard disk drive i mean total space and the age of my cpu means microprocessor it is 12 years old pc here is the microprocessor name intel celeron 900 and 2.20 gigahertz i mean 2.19 gigahertz the processing speed and it is a 64 bit operating system now if you go to pc health checkup app again for checking that is your pc meets the minimum system requirements for installing the windows 11 so i am just gonna click the check now button yes now you can see that this pc doesn't currently meet windows 11 system requirements pc is not supporting secure boot and there is no TPM 2.0 chip and the microprocessor is also not currently supporting. So you can see that my PC doesn't meet the minimum system requirements for installing Windows 11 but I have installed it. So how do you install Windows 11 on your unsupported PC? It is very easy. If your PC is running on Windows then you can easily install the latest Windows 11 on your Windows PC. So first you need to download the ISO file of Windows 10 from the website of Microsoft.com. So I am currently on the website of Microsoft. So you can check that there is a download option. You can select the version or the language. So there is only one version multi edition. You just click on download button to download the ISO file. I have already downloaded it on my Windows PC. You can see there is the ISO file and you need another software for extracting the ISO file into normal files and folders. So you can use any kind of file compression software uh, like WinRAR, WinZip or 7-Zip. You can download any file compression software for extracting the ISO file. So I have installed WinRAR, I mean WinZip for extracting the ISO file. So just right click on the ISO file and then click on show more options because I am on Windows 11 PC. That is why it is showing the show more option and click on WinZip then unzip to folder. It will take a minute for extracting the ISO file ok done here is the extracted folder and you just double click on it to open it you will get a uh, sources folder open it 
now you have to delete a file which is named as appraisers.dll here is the file uh, there are two files one is appraiser and the other is appraisers so you have to delete the appraisers file which is plural please don't delete appraiser you have to delete the appraisers file basically this file check the minimum system requirements so if you delete the appraisers.dll file then windows 11 will not check the minimum system requirements at the time of installing windows 11 on your pc so i'm just gonna delete it just right click on the file make sure that you are going to delete the appraisers.dll file just delete the file and just go back to the main folder and double click on the setup.exe file to install the brand new windows 11 so if you double click on the setup.exe file then the process of installation will be started automatically and windows 11 will not check the minimum hardware requirements for installing windows 11 on your unsupported pc you can check it and it is being installed you can check that it is directly showing that the setup is running so i have already installed windows 11 on my pc and this pc is also running on windows 11 you can check the pc health app it is currently showing that this pc doesn't currently meet windows 11 system requirements and it is being installed so hope you understand that how to install windows 11 on a unsupported pc and i think your issue has been fixed so thanks for watching as always god bless you all thank you